Hi everyone, welcome to Adventures with Moo 42. This is where I will be sharing my garden and food adventures. I'll also be sharing with you my favorite recipes, garden tips, garden projects, and more. Thank you for watching and enjoy! So I'm going to share with y'all how, when, and what it looks like to harvest butternut squash. So this is my gorgeous butternut squash here. So one of the key indicators we look for is this tan coloring as you see here. I'm going to step back and show you all some of my other butternut squash that are growing. So you see here they're green in color. They're green and they have this striping. And here's another one down here. They're green and striping. This one's pretty new as compared to these. As they grow they'll become more tan as you can see here and get that coloring that is typical of butternut squash. So the second thing you look for is the stem here you see how it's kind of withered and it's changed color it's not green and vibrant as compared to down here it's green vibrant. That's the second thing you look for and then something else you look for is you want to make sure that it's hard like I'm feeling it and it feels really hard so that's another trick and then you also don't want to leave it on too long to where it'll get squishy so the three things you look for are the color um, how hard it is like if I, I'm not going to but you can press your fingernail against it and you shouldn't be able to make an indention on here uh, and the stem color so I'm going to go ahead and harvest it. I'm going to just take my handy dandy little clippers here and I'm going to just cut it up here. And then I'm probably going to roast it, but that's the simple way of how you can harvest butternut squash. Anyway, thanks for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. Uh, tell me what else y'all want to see. Anyway, thanks. Bye.